right, folks, so this is a uh, impromptu video. Um, basically, I'm going to be demonstrating a product that I just bought from Amazon. You'll see I'm a Prime member. And this is a honey decapping tool. So let me open this package and I'll show you what it's like. All right, so the packaging is not all that um, eloquent. It's just a, just a box. Okay, so here we have a... Uh, the tool, uh, no instruction manuals or anything fancy. It's just the the tool the tool itself. Okay, folks. So this is what we have. Um, you'll see it's a basically a decapping planer. Um, I believe this little piece here can get adjusted somehow, but you'll see it's got the little the little teeth, and it's got this little plain part. Let me demonstrate this tool using a deep size frame that is capped with honey and we'll see if this thing actually works. As far as the uh, quality, it feels nice. I like the wooden handle. It's wide enough. I have pretty decent sized hands but this is wide enough so it doesn't feel too big or too small. I think I can hold on to this for a few hours without getting cramped. Uh, the weight is pretty good. It, it feels like it's good stainless steel it doesn't feel cheap uh, there's nothing on here that's plastic that I can see so it's just wood with a screw for the handle and then stainless steel so enough rambling let's go test this out folks um, to me right now that was my very first frame using that tool so I probably need a lot more experience trying to use it but um, my initial feelings about it I don't like it it's it, it's more tearing the cappings off than cutting it so I like the pick myself because the pick it only gets the wax off the very top if you use a knife or something like that tool it seems like you're scraping or pulling the top of the cells off and that's really you're losing a lot of honey um, I don't know it's a preference thing I guess but let me try another frame And again, I assume the purpose here is you want to take the bottom of this plane and keep it against the comb and just let the rake naturally take the cappings off. So overall, not too bad of a job. Um, really, there's not too much honey left over in the cappings. I mean, nothing more than what you would expect. So um, as I use the tool a little bit more, I am becoming a little, a little more satisfied with it. Um, I think it's good to have in your beekeeping toolbox just for variety. Uh, I think it will work best if you have uh, frames of honey that are completely flattened. If they're a little bit bowed out or uneven, um, it might not be the best tool to use. Uh, but overall, uh, yeah, it's, it seems to do um, as it's advertised. Uh, there is no adjustment on here, 
at least on this design that I have, there's no way to really loosen anything other than the handle. The handle will unscrew, uh, but the piece itself is all one, one model, so there's really no way to adjust it. Um, but it's working good so far. I'm going to do some more frames, and uh, we'll go from there.